Sarah, take a look at shares of Boeing. Reuters reporting just within the last half hour, and we have confirmed through sources that Boeing plans to delay the development and really the building of the first 777X and those deliveries. Now, this is, let's be clear here, Boeing is not scrapping the program, but because of weak demand for long-haul jets, there is a belief at Boeing, let's slow down the plan to roll out this plane. Remember, it was just in January that they had the first flight of the 777X, and there's demand out there for this type of a wide-body, long-haul jet. But not in this market. There's not a whole lot of demand. And that's why Boeing has made this decision. We, by the way, we've reached out to the company. The company says we have no comment on these reports. So we do not have an official confirmation from Boeing, but we have talked with sources. And, guys, this is not a surprise that Boeing would make this decision, given the fact that international travel, transatlantic, transpacific, really travel around the world it's dead in the water right now, and nobody's expecting to come back anytime soon. And most of the major orders for the 777X, we're talking about Emirates, Qatar, Lufthansa, uh, Al Nippon, all of those airlines right now, they're hurting as much as the airlines here in the United States. So if your customers are not going to be in the market for new long-haul planes anytime soon, the smart thing to do, the prudent thing to do if you're Boeing, is to slow down uh, the ramp-up of uh, or the planned production of the 777X.